Welcome back to Banjo Kazooie. We're not going down this just yet because there's a really weird transparent hill down there. I don't know what that's about, but there's an igloo here. Ah, uh, this is bringing back a uh, Super Mario 64. Wait, how do you use a calculator to solve the patterns? Like, how do you know? Like, do you just read the first three bits of information and then, like, oh, this is exactly what it's gonna be? And, like, guess the rest? Do you use the. Never mind, I'm not gonna talk about. I'm not gonna talk too much about what we're talking about here. Because I want it to be a surprise for anyone who hasn't played this 21 year old game. Ah, uh, so it's like a. A Sudoku puzzle. Hello, what do you have to say? Ekum Fokum. Alright, cool. Only one of you had anything to say. Wait, is there anything in here? No honeycomb piece. Oh, from this level on, I, don't ha I have no idea where all the empty honeycomb pieces are, so... So that's gonna be a bitch. Alright, now... As promised. Down the slide we go. Ah! Gordon, my stomach aches. I shouldn't have... Oh, I said groan. I'm going to say the word groan so that you know that I'm groaning. Alright, um... I think this is how you help him out? Nope. Uh, CPR! Do CPR on him! There's a certain vehicular craft that I have to unlock to, uh... To get him to fucking move. So yeah, I like how, uh... All his kids are like, well, uh, Our father left and never came back. He said he was gonna go to Walmart and get some cigarettes and he hasn't been back since. Meanwhile, he's just down the fucking slope! With his fat, lard-ass, gambling-addicted... Alcoholic self. Just lying there on the ground, not taking care of his kids. That's all right. We'll make him puke it all up. All right, first order of business in this level. Let's ground pound the shit out of this. I missed. All right, easy. I'm gonna get this in one try. We can light up the Christmas tree. Oh, I'm sorry, it's not a Christmas tree. Uh, Rare wanted to uh, keep religion out of this. No, fuck off! Idiot! It wasn't fair. Alright, can I make it in time? Sometimes they'll just spawn right as the Twinklies are getting there, so that I can't... I can't literally do nothing about it. Alright, so I have 50 seconds to get six more in there. Really not too hard of a minigame. Honestly, Mr. Viral was worse than this. I like how not all of them have to make it. Just 25% eh, of them. It's a sacrifice we're willing to make. The music gets faster as if 30 seconds is, I think, oh shit. Alright, it's starting to spawn faster though. Fuck off! Oh god, I might actually lose this. Oh fuck! That's not fair at all. Alright, well, I lost. Yeah, sure, give me a tip. Please try harder this time. Tip for this mini game. <laughs> Don't get cocky. Oh wait, I know what I know what the tip is. Eggs, right? Wait, what? Wait, kill the first one, just run away, like abandon my post. All right, fucking escort missions. I swear to God. Yeah, just 
spawn right as it's coming across. Stand. Oh, stand on the box? Wait, come on. Why am I. My, my attack's working. Fockers? Ah! Come on, this one has to. This one has to. Yes! Yes! I did it! Fuck you! Fuck you, Grinch, you stole Christmas. Alright, so, um. Oh, hello, Mildred. Alright, so I think this is like a three part process. I have to do that Twinkly's mini game, and then I have to do this, and then I have to like fly through a ring or something. God damn it. Whoops. I was trying to, uh, oh god. Alright, where's that flight pilot at? Oh, it's over here. So like, what would I do? Like, kill the first one and stand on top of the box that the Twinklies come out? Do I have to fly through this three times? Fuck! Speedrun tactics, yes. Alright, one more time. Don't fuck this up, mad dog. Yes! Expert piloting! Now watch, I have 50 seconds to grab that, don't I? Dude, I want to see your speedrun. Hyper endemic. I want to see you speedrun this game. Prove that you can do it! Alright. So just keep climbing, right? Oh. Uh... So I have no doubt that the camera probably- Oh, here's a present. Here's a present for you, kids. It's a cup of noodles. Would you like to die of a sodium overdose? Eat ramen. <laughs> Eat more ramen. Well, not a sodium overdose, I guess, but fucking heart failure. Why am I collecting red feathers? Because I used them all trying to get here. Why'd I answer my own question? Because you're insane. Alright, let's do a speed run, speed run way of getting out of here. See ya. Wait, is that a clip or a... Oh, that's a highlight. How long is that? Is that like an entire speed run in one highlight video? Oh, hey, look. New move. Da, 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 da. It's time for some aerial combat. Choose your targets carefully because it's going to hurt you. Cost a red feather and a, uh, and a honeycomb if you miss. Alright, so there's a key... A key reason for that move. As well as other useful stuff you can do with it. Like travel faster. Uh, okay, there's... There's two key reasons for this moves, and one of them... For this move, and one of them is, uh... So these mean-looking snowmen... Oh, 
Oh god. Don't land, don't land. I think the trick I usually use is to, uh... Oh no, it's fine. The trick I usually use is to uh, wait until they fire their snowball and then dodge it by... Alright. I'm glad the uh, hitbox is somewhat forgiving. Sometimes. I'm gonna see if I can... Uh, before landing, I'm gonna see if I can just get all of these. No! Oh, fuck off! Yeah, just land me right in the... F <laughs> just kidding, I would never have kids. That would require me to have sex. <laughs> anyway. Is, is there already two mumbo tokens I've uncovered? Alright, there's the first of many, many empty honeycomb pieces in this level. I've heard there were eight in this level alone. Feathers, alright. Surely there are more, right? Oh, no, that's the last of them because otherwise a Jiggy would not have appeared there. Alright. So the second thing to do with this, uh... With this new move that we learned is, if I can find it, I need to find the front of this really big snow. Oh, there it is, right there. <laughs> so you see those buttons on the on the on the front of him that look like kind of like targets. Oh, good. So I can. So I can do the move in the middle of a. Of ascending. I think we're gonna. I think we're gonna dive. Hopefully, collect some more red feathers because holy shit, that took a lot of red feathers. Between everything I did. And uh, we're gonna work from the ground up. Should I start with the. Uh, with the snowmen, though, or should I explore the caverns more? Find out next time. Wait, never mind. I haven't. Not at 15 minutes yet. All right. I don't know how else to get here, so I'll just take some damage. Oh, never mind. Never mind. I'm pro as pro at this game. All right. So that's how to. That's how to get to that point. And of course, I can't even get that Jiggy until I beat Gobi's Valley. Well, not necessarily beat it, but you know. There's a move that I have to learn. It's the shoes. Spoiler alert. Alright, so this is the second Jiggy? Hmm, yep. Yeah. Got a long way to go, boys. Yeah, we saw the shoes, but we can't learn them until Gobi's Valley. So there's that. There's another health. Wait, is that another Mumbo token? Alright, I need to. Uh... Man, I'm getting so many Mumbo tokens. Alright, I think there's another- oh, there's another Jinjo here. And I'm not getting those notes, no way. Not until I become a, uh... Well, there's a transformation in, in this level. Where are you at? Why can't I get up here? Hello? What's the point of it if I can't get up there? Do I need to... There we go. And I'm not even going to use it because Ginger's back here. Alright. I don't want to cut the video until I uh, have started making my way up. Up the snow, man.
And then there's a race I have to do as the Baron Bird first, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Actually, before we make our way up the snow, man, I might cut it pretty soon. Uh, wait. Never mind. Here's the snowman. I thought I was. Oh, I have to do the race as the as the uh, as the other thing first. Speaking of that, I thought we were gonna meet a certain character. Oh, he's over there, isn't he? All right. Well, next time on Banjo Kazooie, since we're running on to 16, no, 17 minutes now. We're gonna make our way up this uh, rainbow road. Oh no, it's a scarf. And then we might even transform. See you later.